With Jake Libby following the, the Glamorgan game. Um, Jake, a lot of runs scored. Looks a, quite a small margin, 19 runs, but you never really got to, into it, did you? Yeah, that's right. I think, yeah, probably flattered us a little bit the scoreboard in the end. Um, yeah, we were just a little bit off. I think we were obviously disappointed with how we finished with the ball there. Um, that was probably slightly too many runs. Not necessarily on the surface, but from the situation we got ourselves in, how well we bowled to start with, um, I think we'd be disappointed with that. So the run chase wasn't a million miles off. Um, it was a big score ultimately, and, and we just didn't quite get them big scores we needed to chase that score down. You mentioned how well the lads bowled early on. Um, we've talked in the past about the opposition are allowed to play well. Sam Northeast really paced it well, didn't he? Yeah, look, him and Ruti batted superbly there. Obviously, that partnership was, was mammoth and, um, yeah, it took the game away from us and, and fair play to them. Uh, obviously, Sam batted throughout and, um, you know, it was tough at the start. Um, Joe and Dill bowled really well for us. We, we, we nipped it around. It, it did a little bit and, um, yeah, so obviously on a different day you get him out there, but yeah, fair play to him. They batted really well. Another debut for another young player, Ollie Davison. Figures don't look great, but he actually did pretty well, I thought. Yeah, I think that's spot on, to be honest with you. Yeah, um, he actually bowled really well, I thought. Um, he got a few that nicked down to, you know, sort of free first slip there and stuff like that. And yeah, you know, it's, it's what this competition is all about now and, you know, giving young guys a go. And um, there's a few that have done really well for us. You haven't got that much experience as a captain. It can't get much tougher than it did in those last few overs, I would have thought. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it was obviously a challenge today. Um, at times it has been a challenge throughout the comp. But um, yeah, look, we've, we've still got some young bowlers here and um, they're sort of learning their trade. And then guys that haven't bowled death overs a lot. So it obviously went around the park today. On a different day, it goes it goes differently. But um, yeah, it was it was tough. But, you know, like I said, all, all the bowlers are learning. I'm learning from these experiences and hopefully we can we can get better as a group. It's difficult when you don't know whether to have your deep mid wicket in the third row or the sixth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look, I mean, when two set batters are in at the end there, it is very difficult and there's not much margin for error against very good players. And I think the boys learned that today. And um, yeah, you just got to take that one on the chin. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm only joking. Uh, yeah. The pitch, hybrid pitch, third time it's been used, looked a pretty good surface to me. Yeah, no, look, Banksy's done a top job on that. That's the third game we played. Now, we weren't sure how it was going to go. It was going to slurp a little bit or start to grip. And it didn't really. It was a superb wicket for all three games. And um, yeah, fair, fair play. We, we played on three belters there and um, played some good cricket on it as well. But yeah, I'm disappointed with the result. Bit of time off now and then back to the Red Bull. Good to have a break to be able to sort of reset mentally. Yeah, that's right. I think, you know, it's an important September for the club and the players. I think, um, you know, we've got a lot to try and turn around. And um, yeah, like I said, we've got a, a little break now before that. And then it's four real big games to finish in the Red Bull. The Red Bull form has been pretty solid throughout the year. The white ball form, very disappointing. Is it good to have this sort of two week period to be able to sort of put one behind you and really focus? Yeah, that's right. Obviously, the, the white ball stuff's done now this year and we can put all our focus on the Red Bull and, um, you know, a really strong finish hopefully um, I know the guys will be really keen for a, a really good September and, and get some positive results thanks for your time Jake, no Jake uh, three academy players have made the debut during this competition how good has it been for their development yeah and I think you know this competition obviously produces a lot of um, players given their debuts now and, and I think all three have done really good jobs obviously Reeve came in up at Lancashire and did a, a really good job there and um, yeah it's great to see their development and um, you know I hope they've learned a lot from the experiences and obviously Ollie today that'll be a real good experience for him to learn from and yeah it can only help them in their careers obviously they've all had game time but off the field as well in training I mean, how important is that part of it I think, you know, the club have looked at that going forward. The, the characters, all three of them, are, are really good blokes to have around. Um, you know, really hard working and they fit in really well with our group. So moving forward, I think they've got really bright futures.